Oh, hey. What? What are you doing back so early? Are you okay? Is something wrong? Oh, no. Yes, yeah, stood up again. How long were you waiting there for her? Mm -hmm. At least this one told you. Oh, dude, I'm sorry. Mm, this sucks. No, it's not you. You're amazing. Any girl would be lucky to have you. Look at you. You're a total snack. <laughs> and you're such a good listener. You're one of the few people I know that actually gives me your full attention when I'm talking to you. Look. You make eye contact and everything. And I know you retain what I say because you're such a good listener. And I love your cooking. <laughs> When I steal it, when you're not paying attention. <laughs> mm. Oh, it is not you. <sighs> people are just getting cold feet, or these people are just not good for you anyway because they're too flaky. Mm. Hey, 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 wait, 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 wait. Don't go upstairs. I know. Just want to slam the door of your room, punch a pillow, or cry into a pillow, or whatever, and feel completely shitty for the rest of the evening, but instead of feeling like complete shit, <laughs> maybe we could have like a little role play date. Like, <laughs> like, no, not like an actual date. I'm, no, 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 no. Like, <laughs> like, we can just have like a little date night together as roommates and maybe I can snuggle up a little bit and give you that human contact that you're craving and I can say a bunch of sweet things about you. <laughs> and you don't have to get all worried because it's not real. We're just friends. We're just roomies. And <laughs> it's just a little fun little activity. Not a real thing that you have to get all nervous about. <laughs> yeah. A little role play date. <laughs> How about it? Yeah. Just snuggle up on the couch so I can say nice things about you. Mm, come on, come on, come on. No moping, no moping. Come on. Mm. <laughs> yes, I meant it. When I called you cute, I really meant it. Mm. <laughs> yeah. Mm. I know, I know. Mm. You're in the girls. <laughs> That's okay. Mm, I'm not trying to hit on you or anything. <laughs> mm, you know me. I just like to make you feel good. Come on. Here. If you're not comfortable, come on. <laughs> then we don't have to get close. <laughs> we can have our three feet of separation. Mm, but I just want to make you feel good. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what do you want to watch? I want some Netflix. One of these 8 million Netflix specials has to be a little intriguing, right? Mm. Ooh, what about the sad horse show? <laughs> Bojack, the depressed horse? <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> yeah, maybe we don't need to watch something depressing and lonely and... Okay. Uh, ooh, we can watch some <laughs> some nature documentaries. Those are always super cute. Yes. David Attenborough. Yes. <laughs> you really are a handsome guy. And I'm not trying to flirt with you. <laughs> I'm just trying to make you feel better. I don't want you to be uncomfortable, but I also want you to know that you're a great guy. Mm. Not the reason that you're getting stood up a lot isn't your fault. It's not because of you. You always follow through. You're always persistent and caring and you listen. It's, I don't know, just dating websites are hard. And I know you've been putting a lot of effort into these, but... I don't know. You have to stick with it and 
eventually somebody's going to click. Eventually someone's going to find you for who you are and actually go on a date with you. And when they go on a date with you, they'll see you for you. And it'll be as simple as that. Hmm. Hey, come on, just try it. Try laying your head on my shoulder. It'll feel good. <laughs> you don't have to be shy. I'm not going to bite. I'm not going to seduce you and make you turn gay. <laughs> No, 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 no. I respect your sexuality. I just want to give you some human contact. It doesn't have to be weird for guys to t to be close to each other. <laughs> it's okay. I'm not going to infect you with cooties. I'm not a girl. <laughs> mm. Yeah. Let's just have some background nature documentary. All the cool sea slugs and birds and <laughs> eating frenzies in the oceans and sharks and yes. I'm going to just pay attention to you a little bit. You know, if you want to cry, that's okay. I'm not going to judge you. It's okay to be a man that cries. <laughs> I understand that men have emotions too, <laughs> and I won't think any less of you for having emotions. <laughs> okay, maybe another day then. I'll crack you open slowly. <laughs> I'll make a soft boy out of you yet. <laughs> a soft boy, like a sweet, emotional... Touchy-feely, <laughs> sappy guy. <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, you can hide it around everybody else. You can be all tough and stuff in front of other people. <laughs> Do you mind if I just scratch your hair a little bit? <laughs> just tell me if it becomes uncomfortable. If you ever want me to stop. I'll stop. Mm, does that feel good? Mm. <laughs> mm, it's been months since you've had any human contact. I don't know how you do it. No wonder you're trying to go on so many dates. Mm, but you know, <laughs> if you ever just want to snuggle with me in a platonic way, I'm always here. I'm not going to make it weird. <laughs> I'm not gonna make you call me later. I'm not gonna assume we're in a relationship. We can just have platonic snuggles with no strings attached. I know it's crazy, right? <laughs> You'll just be my snuggle buddy with benefits. <laughs> Roommates with snuggle benefits. There we go. Does that feel good? You have nice hair. Mm. <laughs> You've never had a guy tell you that? Mm, well, you do. Your hair's really soft. I hope you'll find a girl who will play with it for you. <laughs> mm -hmm. Mm. Oh my god. Look at that gazelle run. <laughs> oh yeah. I'm paying attention to you. Look at you. <laughs> Getting needy. <laughs> yeah, am I warm enough? You on a blanket, a couch blanket. Here. <laughs> Get nice and cozy. Get all burritoed up. And then rest your head back on my shoulder. There you go. <laughs> Good boy. <laughs> you like that? Mm, good. Good boy. There you go. See? <laughs> Guys aren't so bad. <laughs> mm, you're a guy. And you're pretty good. Pretty good. You're alright. 
You're a roommate that I can kind of handle. <laughs> that I can mostly put up with. <laughs> mostly. Mm. But seriously. Mm, this isn't your fault. There's nothing wrong with you. There's a reason that so many people talk to you and message you. And respond back to you. You're cute. Just because you're getting stood up doesn't say anything about you. People are just getting cold feet or people are just shitty or dating websites are just shitty. I don't know. What I do know is it's not you. Because I know you. And you're amazing. Mm. <laughs> nice and toasty now. Mm. Good. Mm. This is much better than sobbing in your pillow, right? Mm. I'm glad you let me do this. <laughs> mm. Yeah, it's just two cuddling guys. No homo. <laughs> Mm, it's okay. You know, you know, girls do this all the time. Mm, girls are, can be really touchy-feely, snuggly, especially when they're single. can be really hard to go without physical contact as a human for too long. And girls play with each other's hair and they snuggle. Why can't guys do it too? There's nothing wrong with this. Mm, I'm not asking for anything more. You're not asking for anything more. So why can't we just help each other feel good? Mm. <laughs> See, it's not so scary. My fingers can make you feel good. <laughs> mm, guys can touch each other more than just hitting each other. <laughs> guys can make each other feel good instead of making each other feel pain. <laughs> mm. Mm. This will be our little date night. <laughs> mm -hmm. Platonic date night. Maybe. You could even cook me something. <laughs> or cook yourself something and just go to your room and eat it and then come back for a little three seconds and the seconds are gone. <laughs> Has it happened to you before? Interesting. <laughs> and I'm the only roommate. What? What could it be? I told you your cooking was good. <laughs> Any girlfriend you have would really appreciate your cooking. If you intend it for her or not. <laughs> mm, that's the thing about roommates. You can't just cook something and not share. <laughs> it's okay. I'll return the favor. I'll cook you up something. <laughs> uh-huh. Mm, see, this is nice. You should totally come talk to me before you sob into a pillow. Mm. I keep saying that because I've heard you. The walls aren't that thick. <laughs> when you're sobbing, you give me kind of loud. Mm. Yeah, but once or twice is still enough. Mm. Oh. I know it's hard out there. Mm. I'm here for you, okay? Do we already need to talk or... Just watch something stupid on Netflix, or need some sort of physical contact, then I'm here. I'm here for hugs, back rubs, hand rubs, <laughs> whatever. Mm. <laughs> I do think you're a catch. Mm. And I do think you're going to find the right person. Mm. Yeah. Just a matter of time. Just be patient. Keep your head up. You got this. They'd be lucky to have you. <laughs> I promise.